On Friday, November 17th at 12.30 p.m., a student organization at Ohio State, Students for Justice in Palestine, also known as SJP, led a demonstration at Thompson Library by showcasing the scroll that was positioned from the fourth floor of the library and continued outside of the building past the statue of William Oxley Thompson. According to members of SJP, more than 4,000 names of Palestinian children who were killed in Israeli airstrikes are on the scroll. I mean, it's been more than 40 days since uh, Israel started bombing Gaza, and there has been over 6,000 children um, who were killed mm -hmm. by Israeli airstrikes, and nothing has been done on OSU's part, nothing has been done on um, the administration, and so we're trying to really uh, bring a visual demonstration because clearly all our demonstrations, all our educational teachings, all our meetings with them um, have amounted to nothing. And so we're trying to really bring a visual representation of all the kids that were brutally mur murdered by Israel. And so um, this list does, I think, a really good job of showing you these are not even all the kids. We, when we made this list, it was 4,300 and now it's at 6,000. So you know, just to even fathom the amount of children being killed in a rate of a, like an unthinkable rate that should be inhumane, that is beyond humanitarian crisis even. And yeah, just really just showing the university where their fundings are going to and what the students think about um, their stance. It's, it's like so emotional for me to see that many children being being murdered and see all their names all at once and realize how long this list is. it goes it's from the top of thompson all the way outside of thompson past the statue into the middle of the oval that should show something and the fact that the list is incomplete with the more children that are dying every single day it's just it's it's heartbreaking